This is a Geiger counter. It was the first scientific instrument I ever made. It was very exciting. And it's a very simple device, but it's exquisitely sensitive. What you've got is a thing called a Geiger Muller tube on the front here, which is basically a metal cylinder. There's a very thin mica window on the front, and there's a wire going through the middle, and there's a gas at low pressure. Now in the box, there's some electronics that produces a high voltage, which goes between the outside and the thin wire in the tube. Now when an ionizing radiation comes in, it causes the gas to conduct electricity, and basically you hear a click in the loudspeaker. So one single, single particle coming in will produce a click in the loudspeaker, and a click in the loudspeaker probably requires a billion electrons to move. So you're going from one particle to a billion electrons moving. Uh, so you've got a magnification of effectively a billion times with this very simple apparatus. So let's turn it on. You can hear a click in the loudspeaker. That's the natural background radiation coming from the rocks below me and from the cosmic rays coming in from space. Usually about 50 clicks per minute for this sort of size tube. I've got some americium here. This is the sort of thing they use in smoke detectors. And it's an alpha emitter, so it doesn't go very far in air. So you can't pick it up on the Geiger counter until you get a bit close. You can hear it clicking away. That might be 100 clicks per second. But because the thing's so exquisitely sensitive, it doesn't really represent much radiation. I've got here a bit of pitch blend. This is a naturally occurring mineral of uranium, but there's other stuff in it as well. And it's an alpha and a beta emitter, so which is why you can hear it clicking a bit further away from the tube. So you can hear it clicking away. So essentially it's a very simple apparatus. There's a Geiger Muller tube, there's a little generator for high voltage, and there's the loudspeaker, and that's the Geiger counter.